The World Championships will get underway in Ponferrada this weekend, with the team time trial. This year is the third running of the event after it was inaugurated at the Falkenberg Championships in 2012. With many riders focusing on the road race, some big names are missing, but it has still attracted a stellar field. In fact, Linda Willemsen is the only individual medalist from last year that isn't competing. Can the riders convert individual into team success? Here are Cycling News' top five teams to watch for the team time trial. With Tony Martin at the helm, there is little surprise that a mega farmer quick step has been so dominant in this event. However, it's not just the individual world champion that brings the horsepower. Among the six men selected for Pomparada are the classic specialists Nicky Terpstra and Tom Bonin, and current Polish TT champion Mikol Kwiatkowski. Julian Vermont is also part of the lineup after a strong end to the season, with Peter Seri completing it. The course is slightly more undulating than it was in Florence, but they showed in Valkenburg that it wasn't a problem. Like Quickstep, Specialized Lululemon will go into the event as the overwhelming favourites, after winning the first two editions. In 2013, the team smashed the opposition with a winning margin of more than a minute. The final selection is yet to be announced, but world silver medalists Evelyn Stevens and Carmen Small will be linchpins in the six-woman team. Junior World and two-time German champion Lisa Brenauer provides yet more strength for the team. They lose individual champion Ellen van Dijk, but with the riders they're bringing to Spain, few would be surprised if they took a third title. In what was almost a mirror image of the Tour de France team time trial earlier last year, Orca Greenedge was pipped to the world title by less than a second. After the close call in Florence, they've chosen to leave the team almost unchanged. Darren Limpy is out, and in comes reigning under 23 world champion Damien Housen. Current and former Australian champions Michael Hepburn and Luke Durbridge will be by the backbone of the team, as will five-time Canadian champ Svein Tuft. After third and second, they have a strong chance of gold this weekend. The Rebel Live women's team head to Spain in commanding form. Earlier this month, they dominated the Lotto Bellasol Belgium Tour with Annemiek van Vleuten and Anna van der Breggen. Mariana Voss only adds to an already strong team as they look to improve on last year's silver. They fired off a warning shot in Belgium by winning the team time trial by 43 seconds over giant Shimano. Specialised weren't at the race, but they'll be aware of how the Dutch team is going and will face some stiff competition from them. The giant Shimano men's team could be a wildcard for this year's event. They've never really featured as contenders for the podium, but the ascension of Tom Dumoulin this season could see that change for them. This year's team is barely recognisable to the one from Florence, with Tobias Lugvigsen the only other survivor. Marcel Kittel began his career as a time trialist and makes his debut in the event. He'll provide a big boost in power and we can see the team make the podium for the first time.